Hey guys, this is Josiah here. Welcome to another 2023 NFL schedule predictions. Today we're going to be doing the New York Jets, the third team that I'm doing in the AFC East. Tomorrow I will do the Dolphins. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and get in with it. So as you can see, currently the Jets are sitting at 3-2. Pretty, pretty solid, right? Uh, but I have them in week one on Monday Night Football losing to the Bills at home. Not very good, not a very good start there. Uh, I think it's going to take time for the Jets to develop, maybe. I don't know. I just think the, I, I just think the Bills are a very, very good team. It's going to be hard to beat them. Cowboys are also a good team, but I do see the beating them, though. I do think they'll, 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 they'll get it. I haven't beaten the Patriots, as you saw in the last predictions. They're currently sitting at 2-1. and one. They go up against the Chiefs. This is a tough schedule to start off. Uh, very, very tough schedule. Uh, they go up against the Chiefs. I think Patrick Mahomes and the Chiefs, they're too good, okay? They're going to start off 2-2, two and two, which is mid, literally mid. It's 2-2. Two and two. Um, They'll get an easy one over the Broncos. I don't think I need to say anything Say anything about that. You got the Eagles at home. See, see these are home teams. Like, if you look at the Bills, minus the Cap, but, like, the Bills, Chiefs, and Eagles, those are all whole hard opponents, but they're all at home. Like, that's interesting. Um, I just can't help myself to think... The why can't the Jets get at least one of them? They can't get they can't get at least one of them. Uh, I'm just looking at their looking at their future of schedule future schedule. Um, uh, I'll have them. Uh, what should I? Do? I'll have them upsetting the Eagles. I'll have them upsetting the Eagles. I feel like they could this could be like a game winning field goal type thing. I think it'll be very very close. I would not obviously no one's gonna be shot if either one of these teams wins. It could be a very very competitive game. I uh, think the Jets are going to outlast the Giants. They play them in the preseason, but no one cares about the preseason. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, we got the Chargers. I think they'll beat the Chargers. Chargers, I think will be. I think they'll be in the hunt, but I don't. I just don't think they're going to be like oh big big team this year. Um, I know they got plagued by injuries last season, mostly in their defense. So we'll see. They'll get an easy one of the Raiders. Like I keep saying, the Raiders. I don't think it'll be, they'll be good with Jimmy Garoppolo this season. I just don't see much coming from them this season, and especially if Josh Jacobs sits out this season which it's likely now, um, then uh, it's, they're definitely not going to be good. Uh, the Dolphins will get a win. Uh, they'll be getting Jalen Waddle back at this point, I think, right? No? I don't know. Uh, week 12, what's that going to be? Week 12. Uh, week 12. i got to do some research. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay, I just looked it up, and my camera's not... There we go. <laughs> I looked it up. It's late November. Jalen Waddle will not be there in time. Or not Jalen Waddle. Jalen Ramsey. So that means the Jets are going to win. Um, I think Jalen Ramsey, I don't know if it's going to hurt the Dolphins a lot, but it'll hurt a little bit. But tomorrow we'll do the Dolphins. We'll talk more about that. They'll get easy wins over the Falcons, the Texans. Maybe the Texans can do good with CJ Stroud. They got some good players like Devin Singletary. I know they got him. They got uh, um, Dalton Schultz, but I don't know. Uh, week 15, he'll definitely be back by then. Therefore, the Jets are going to, or not the Jets, the Dolphins are going to um, tie the Jets in the series are going to sweep or sl split. That's what that's what the I couldn't think of the word for a second. Uh, they'll beat the Commanders. That's an easy win. And I already have the beat of the Browns. I already have them losing the, the to the to the Patriots. So that's going to put them at thirteen and four. And I actually agree with that. Okay, I think they're going to be a good team. They got a lot of good pieces. You know, I think the, I think they're going to be good. I think Aaron Rodgers and the Jets. They got a lot of good things in the future. Um, I have them going 13-4, and four, and they're, they're tied with the Bills, but as you can see, I have them losing the AFC East to the Bills. I guess it goes by division, in which the the Bills, I guess, are going to have that according to this predict, predictor thingy. Um, so, yeah, four losses to the Bills, Chiefs, uh, Dolphins, and then the Patriots. I think they're going to be... Patriots might be fighting for... I don't know. I think they're going to be... I don't know why. I, I don't know why. I had the peach because 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 in the last prediction I have them right now going seven and ten. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I, I don't know why. I just don't see. I think the Jets will be fighting for the one seed, and I think the Patriots are going to put an upset at home. I just think that that's what's going to happen. Week eighteen has an upset. I think. Why not? I'm sorry. That's not. I, I don't know. I don't know. We, no one knows until the season starts. I guess. Uh, but anyways, that's gonna do for this uh, Jets schedule prediction. So hope you guys enjoyed. Smash like, subscribe, hit the notification bell if you want to. That's clout. I don't support that. Just do it as a suggestion. But anyways, I'll see you guys in tomorrow's Dolphins schedule prediction video. See you guys. Bye.